Good evening, everybody. Today, tonight, Friday night, I want to discuss with you the warning signs of what I was doing, the bad behavior that I was doing before I got hooked on heroin. Okay? So, before, before I got hooked on heroin a few months ago, I would say that there was never a time in between where I wasn't willing to do prescription opiates. Now, I abused prescription opiates multiple times. I even overdosed one time and got this nice little cut right there. You see that? I fell right on my face, took too many codeines right on my face, could split my eyebrow right wide open, and, um, I mean, if I heard that you were having the surgery, I'd ask you if I could pay you for your opiates, if I, if I heard that you were into blow, I'd fucking hit you up and say, hey, you want to go halves on a gram, I'm like, I just didn't give a fuck, I really didn't, and, um, I would say that, the the three, the three major warning signs when I was back in, here in California was number one, I went to go hang out. I went to go hang out with an old addict friend of mine and her boyfriend, and we went golfing, and we did a bunch of blow and went golfing, and that was fun until I realized that her... <laughs> That's my name. And, uh... It was all fun and games until I realized that that um, the boyfriend was doing heroin in the bathroom, and it made me want to do it. And I asked them, "Can I do it with you?" And they said, "No." And that made me do even wanting to do it even more. And then number two, I got a colonoscopy. So I got a colonoscopy. They fucking gave me fentanyl. They gave me fentanyl to fucking twilight me. And I fucking was the wizard of Nod for while the fucking weird doctor shoved a camera at my ass. Fucking, I got out of that fucking colonoscopy feeling fucking shame and a light pain in my booty. It was fucking gay. It was gay. Then what finally tipped the iceberg was I went to go hang out with an old high school friend and he gave me, um, he gave me an opportunity, and I went to go to a, a fucking drug house, and and uh, they put heroin right in my face. I fucking snipped it, and uh, about an hour later, I fucking called him up to see if I can get some more, and I shot it up. And then for like a good month, maybe five weeks straight, I was just fucking wrecked, just angry. I was actually planning on running for mayor. Believe it or not, I was actually planning on running for mayor of my city before I got into heroin. That's how much of a role I was on, man. Probably a good thing I didn't run for mayor. But, um, let me relight this again. Hold on. So yeah, add another warning sign, anger. If you are not willing to fucking, well, after I quit my boxing gym, after I quit my boxing gym, major anger problems because I wasn't able to fight at will. At, I'm back in the real world. And anger that isn't expressed outwardly is going to turn into pain and you're going to want to self-medicate maybe. Pity God, the type of person you are. So, yeah, guys, uh, try your best to be happy. Do your best to just drink a lot of water, smoke a lot of weed. Be happy. Be around other happy people that like their life. And, uh,
Yeah, that's it. Bye.